Is yeah, that a true. realistic construct? Of course oh, it is. Gosh, is it realistic to say no. that the universe what? is eternal? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Um, what do you mean, what do you mean by that? I don't so, so the point is, is, I don't know I, he's, he's accountable and responsible for the actions he undertakes, guys, right. but he's not to blame for being in that state of mind that he would do those actions. No, wait, wait, wait. He's not to blame for doing the state of mind that he does that because it wasn't his choice to be in that state of mind. Okay, not to be in that state of mind, but to do it, he is to blame. No, not to blame. He's responsible for his actions. Well, and we're not we are responsible, responsible for his Semantics, come on. You know what I'm saying? Definition means there's a tough, a bare consequence for what I do. And Everyone's what, got what consequences. And you what's the consequences that he bears? The consequences is that he will potentially be put in prison to protect but the no society. For no fault of his own. <laughs> for no fault of his own. Just well, bad okay, luck, uh, what, I guess. Well, yeah, it is actually. So you're saying you don't agree the whole moral Speaking value system? system and you're yeah, saying that no one has got free will. will. You don't believe in any justice system, yeah, in other words. No, 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 no. So, so you're saying that to the all justice system now is just to protect the public. To public protection. Yeah. Oh, man. I wonder no, why you, no, you, you want no no so your public protection may I ask has got consequences. No, no. So then, what so defines we good and evil? If we, were living, in a, if we were living in a very small village, there's maybe five of us. We're all quite armed. We're all uh, we're all able to defend ourselves. And he kills a baby, but there are only five people in the village. We can easily demolish him physically, but we decide we'll put him in prison. It's not to protect us. It's a consequence. For him, there's no good and evil. No, there's no you don't believe in good and evil then? If there's no I justice system, there's no good I and evil. I don't label behaviours in the terms of good and evil. So what do you define as good and evil? I just told you, I don't define things in that context. Oh man, there's no good and evil. Well, these, uh, are there men and women? I see a lot are of good genders? Are there genders? Are there genders? Let's not, let's not broaden this. It's bad enough as it is. We're talking about men. I, I see a lot. I, 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 you, you, you respect the whole, you view the whole universe as there's no good and evil at all. Yeah. You, do you see that as a logical? Do you see that logical? Evidently, I do, yes. Yeah? yeah. Really? Yeah. Quite interesting. There's no good I know it's not logical. You know that. Well. I know it. Totally. I tell you, I tell you. How can I, it be logical look, when you don't even believe that there is good and bad in this world? I'll give you. I'll give you. I'll give you. I'll give you. For all three. For all. Hold on, hold on. For all three representatives of the major Abrahamic religions. Welcome. Um, <laughs> here's a here's a possibility that um, that humanity has created a, a god-like system, a mon monotheistic god system that uh, puts the power of their society into a more powerful kind of god-like system, and that has been propagated throughout time to create. Uh, a degree of social control, not necessarily. Right, no, 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 What's more hypothetically possible? So, for instance, if we, if if a, another out of solar system uh, set of beings created humans through genetic engineering, and then wanted to be treated like the god and the creator of those humans, then you would be potentially uh, worshiping that group of creators. However, the they're, those creators are also have a consciousness, so that consciousness is actually universal, out of time and space. So, in in a sense, what is actually the observer consciousness in them is the universal consciousness that I'm talking about. No, but about. your universal consciousness define that. Define just, universal it's consciousness. Just, it's just. It's just. It's just. It's just. Yeah. It's just. How is that a so definition? People, Same as God. No, it's not no. because God is not God consciousness. Just is. God just. God is. is not consciousness. He's not conscious. He's not consciousness. What is it? You're, you're conscious. saying it as if you're saying he's not conscious. conscious. No, no, I'm not saying God is not consciousness. consciousness. I'm saying it is not. God is a creator. It's not conscious. In fact, your consciousness itself is a creation of God. The fact that you are aware of your... I'd, you say, I'd, say, I'd say the mercy and the attributes that you give to Jesus... I don't give them. He told me about them. I don't Jesus, give them. Father, Allah. 
are anthropomorphized nice uh, projections you know of, human, of human okay. mercy. In fact, that is the last thing you can say about the Muslims. Because we do, not, we do not have an okay. anthropomorphic view of God. And you should know you, that. You have the mercy? The shape of wait, wait. Allah. Let's what is, go there. So, so you're saying the animals show mercy? Does that mean you're an animal? No, what I'm saying. What, is, what okay, kind can of I ask you then, please? So you're saying that groups of humans came together of their own free will, I would add, and um, imagined and constructed a set of moral principles by which to guide their societies and ascribed these, um, you know, beneficent feelings and maybe punishment to an all-powerful God and therefore created Him. And I would argue that if they have the innate... Um, desire to have justice and mercy and peace and love and patience and kindness as opposed to murder, theft, rape, etc. I would suggest that that is the image of God in them before they have the idea to get together to make the society. So you're, it's a kind of chicken and egg thing, but humans at one point were very few on the earth. We never, this because we're not eternal, because this, this world is not eternal, we have grown in number exponentially to the point where there are billions, whereas in the past there were hundreds of thousands, and at one point there were two in our world. So the point being that not all these societies, so remote African tribes, uh, Venezuelan rainforest people, es uh, Inuit people, they couldn't have all had this same idea to ascribe beneficence to an external creator. Can I, Surely, can I, can I answer to that? What's the logic or the, the probability? Well, look, I'm just about to answer that. Yeah. Okay, so many societies ascribe thunder and lightning as anger of the gods. True, true or false? True, true. Are you saying currently? Great gods, they do. Throughout, throughout Bristol? time. Bristol? No, I'm joking. Are you saying currently? Actually, that's, that's a physical phenomenon. So. I don't so know what you're trying to say. In the so, past. So, so I'm saying that if primitive ah, groups okay, of people... Primitive. No. Well, if you... No, 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 actually, no, 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 the primitive people who consider thunder they said it was as, use. as being the wrath of God, yes? Yes. In your worldview, that is God. No. Because you're a pantheist. Okay. So For him, everything, the whole universe is God included. Pantheist means the manifestation of, of God as universe, basically. Correct yeah. me if I'm wrong. Yeah. So, so, yeah. The, so yeah. the, the thunderbolt, in your case, my friend, would be God. Yeah. So the, so the issue, manifestation the of God. Is manifestation of reality, yes. Well, God, according to you. Well, Everything would you say it's a manifestation of reality? Well, it's a, it's a law. Then we're in agreement. Then we're in agreement. It's basically a physical but phenomenon. You're ascribing a law like physics. everything. Okay. Sorry, a can, can, can I get this point out first? Let's try. I'll try, I'll try. So the issue is, in primitive people in the past uh, would ascribe uh, the gods to certain physical things like for instance thunder yes. lightning and they would ascribe emotions emotions to that behavior so that uh, they Phenomena. would say yes. the gods are angry the gods are got wrathful it, it, and, right. and it is so you said well why does everyone do this around the world no 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 you said yes. with, why does everyone yes. in the tribe I'm answering you no, the tribes around the world why do they ascribe this creator god and what no, I'm saying is and what I'm saying yeah, is that we that. ascribe emotions to, and power to the things we don't understand and that's what and I'm saying they humanity is no, no, no. but aren't you aren't you guilty of doing the same thing uh, you have you have you have ascribed power and basically majesty in some way to the universe, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So you are guilty of the same thing as those primitive people. I don't know why you call them primitive, because your idea is exactly as them which you call primitive. No, well, I yes, for you everything is God. So if there was some waste over there, that would be God. If there would be some diamonds over there, that would be God. So regardless of what in the universe, every material matter, for you is God. I, what I, what I, did what I mean? Say, no, that's primitive. No, what did I say? What, what did, well, what, what I said actually to you before was right, that actually, God's not in the supermarket. There is, no, there is no material matter. This is all what energy. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you mean there's There is no material matter. The only reason, the only reason why there is any mass 
is because of the Higgs field, which is a quantum field. Yeah. How would you define matter? Wait, matter. Wait, how do you define matter? Let's see. Energy. Matter is just energy? Yeah. And is energy matter? No, energy yeah. equals... So then matter is existing. Matter. Thank you very much. <laughs> energy equals mass. If it, what's Science school. Einstein. What did you say? Yeah. 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 Mass I, times energy. The all, 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 of light twice. all of this universe is, is a set of fields. Yes. There is no, there is no solid There's anything. No it's a, it's a way, wave where, function. Where did energy come from? I can't follow what you're Let's saying. Let's if you know. I, I'm where, where did energy understand come from? What it doesn't mean no, I rubbish. understand what you're did, saying. I don't ad, understand wait, how you get to that. Wait, one minute. Where did energy come from according to you? According to me, it just is. It's just is? No, no, where did it come Where's the origin? It's, it's the same kind of thing as no, God, isn't it? No, just no it's is. not eternal. Energy is not eternal, if that's what you're trying to say. I think you're talking energy about the, is the energy is finite. No, it's, it's not. finite. No scientists define energy as eternal. Electricity yeah. runs because out. Because you see, energy, if you, look, away. if you read the law of thermodynamics, wait, wait, wait. If you, what do you mean which version? How many the versions are there? Conservation of energy. Energy, energy can't be destroyed. Energy basically it can be Energy cannot be even destroyed. cannot even exist without a closed system. Okay, so energy has been defined as so it cannot be created or destroyed in a closed system. It cannot be what? Created or destroyed yeah. in a closed yeah. system. Yeah. No. Okay? Yeah. And something you need to realize that is this is one of the laws of thermodynamics. Another law is about entropy. Entropy is where actually it, everything, for example, which is energy, it actually deteriorates in terms of energy. For example, if you had a car and you kept it for 10,000 years, it won't be a car anymore because it has deteriorated. So everything that is energy has deterioration. It does the order. What about the order? Entropy is order. It's not the energy. It's the it's the order. Yeah, the order basically comes. Not the energy. The order, which is organized at one point, yeah. comes to an end. The order comes to an end. Yes. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. So not everything. Because you say energy is eternal, it doesn't make it eternal. It does. It has an you origin. You haven't proved anything different to that. You've I all have. You've I said, told you you you've all, system. You've talked about entropy. This is a closed closed system. Yeah, but it, this is a closed. No system. scientist says the universe is eternal. This is a closed system. Yeah, after its creation. Yeah, after its existence, yes. But before. They it didn't, it didn't used to even exist. Scientists don't know, but what they are... Scientists don't know? What they are, no, no, but what they are saying now... My friend, your God is, is the creation of... Multi-universe. Your, your God is the creation of my God. That's it. End of it. Okay? Anyway, thanks for your time. Assalamu alaikum. I just, told, I just told him, his God is the creation of my God. Well, our God. Our God. Because <laughs> we believe in one God. I'm just very happy to see you, been, God. you know, had a nice chat on the same side for once. Well, come more Stop often. Stop raining. And we'll, uh, we'll no, but honestly, you know, people who believe in uh, the universe as God, you believe in the cre creation as God. That's what it boils down to. Well, that's the choice.